get dressed with me to head off to an odd news event but as we can see everywhere's just a mess because i've currently got builders in so we are working with a reduced wardrobe but it is odd news's valentine's dinner tonight and i selected this dress from the website i haven't actually even tried it on so i don't know if it fits me fingers crossed i have been lusting after this dress since i saw it in their fashion week show oh okay i think it's actually a little bit loose which i'd much rather something be a bit loose than too tight i'm obsessed the big color details like everything i'm not sure if i can i don't know if i can do it up myself i am going to remove my garment because she does not add to the look in my head, I have two different ways of styling this. Now, as I said, I'm working with a reduced wardrobe because literally all my stuff is everywhere. Go simple, go all black, go classic. The theme is white, red, <laughs> white, white, <laughs> white, black, and red. So these would be fitting. Do like a black lube and then do a simple little black coach bag but like i know everyone's gonna be matching outfits so it's like how do i make my outfit different but then this is like the most simple version of styling don't know about the clips also i would wear a red lippy but i just don't think a red lippy's me anymore so i can't help that um okay different option i could do a knee-high boot this feels slightly more appropriate because also, don't judge I'm putting on a knee-high boot without a sock on, okay? I wouldn't actually go out like that, I'm just for the sake of trying on. Um, I am going to have to get the train and the tube on a Tuesday night by myself. Hmm, not sure on the knee-high. I feel like if I had two of the knee-highs, it's just going to be like quite black and just make it look a little bit like sultry. And I don't think that's the vibe I'm going for. I'll try it just in case. Mm -mm. I kind of like it, but I kind of think it makes it look Halloween-y with the boots. Options I have are these little ego heels, but I feel like that's just a bit much. Like, I don't feel like I need... No, I don't like those. I think we're going back to the lubes. Stirring. Yeah, yeah. Bare legs, bare legs for the win. I need to moisturise. Okay, then it's like, okay, do I do the black? And then I found these earrings. Oh, they are the moment. They are the moment. The other suggestion I was going to make was to bring in pink and do like a pink bow in my hair. I don't think I actually like it. I don't like the pink. We're sticking with the dark. Pop these big boy earrings in. Um, then I'm thinking I just like brush the hair behind the ears. The builders, when I go downstairs, are literally going to be like, who's this girl? Because this is not the girl that has been walking around the house for the last week. And um, this is by far the most dressed up I've been this year. But I am ready. Sorry, you can't see the fit that well. <laughs> but here is the final look. I am now off to scare everybody on the tube and the train. Um, I am going to take a coat, of course. I, that is my Ganny <laughs> waterproof coat, which has an equally obnoxious collar as this dress. And I'm just gonna do like so. I don't know if it's take a cardigan to go in between. I don't wanna freeze. But here is me. I am off and ready to go to the odd news dinner. Mm.